Magic Wand is a tool in the DesignWorks software that has multiple uses. And during this video, you will learn three different uses for the Magic Wand tool. First, we're going to look at how the Magic Wand tool can save you lots of time when adding color to a design. We'll work through the wizard. And in From File, click on Browse and navigate to the Bernina Design Work Samples folder, find your training folder, and select Tendril and Flower Picture, and click on Open, and then simply work through the wizard. Now this is a painted black outline design, and we can quickly and easily add color to this design. Magic Wand is found with your drawing tools, and if you rest your cursor on the lower black triangle in the right hand corner and drag your cursor to the last tool. This is the magic wand tool. And when you select that tool, you'll notice that the cursor changes into a magic wand. We want to select the color and so you'll go to the color palette. In the colors that can be used, you can scroll through the palette and to add an outline color, you'll click in the upper left hand corner of the color chip. And in the dialog box that opens, the default choice is for that design only and you'll click OK. Then come back to the color palette and click in the lower right hand corner to select your fill color. Again, clicking OK in the dialog box that opens. Now you'll want to scroll in and all you have to do to add color is to click inside the object that you want to add that color combination to. When you're ready to select a new color, simply click on the rectangle selection tool or you can click on the space bar on your keyboard and then deselect by clicking outside the selection rectangle. Then repeat those same steps. Select the magic wand, scroll through your color palette, choose your outline color, choose your fill color, and then zoom in to add color to those objects. The smaller the object, the more you're going to have to zoom in. And then don't forget, you also have a pan icon that is housed with the zoom tools. You can use pan to scroll around the design, just reselect the magic wand, and then click in those remaining areas to add that color. And let's choose one more color. Again, select the rectangle selection, deselect, select the magic wand, scroll through to find the colors you wish to add for the remaining objects. Clicking on a color chip for the outline as well as the fill, and then zooming into those areas and add your outline and fill colors. Now you'll notice that there is a black outline around all the design. And if you wish to delete that black outline, it's a very simple step. Come down to your color palette and right click on the black color chip, select by pen color and press delete. And that will leave only the outline and fill colors that you chose for your design. So this is one use for the magic wand tool. Let's explore some other uses. Select file new. And this time, when we work through the wizard, we're going to select a new graphic and open up a blank design. 
Select one of the drawing tools and draw an object. And then let's select that same circle and create some objects that are going to be on top of your original drawn object. To create holes is the second use of the magic wand. And so we have our setup where we have objects on top of a larger object. Simply select your magic wand and come and click on the background. And then when you move that object away, you can see that you have created an object that has holes. The objects can be totally within the background object or they can straddle the edge of an object and create a partial hole. So the second use of the magic wand tool is to quickly and easily create holes. The third use is to fill those holes back up. So to do that we'll select the magic wand tool, select the color that we wish to use, and come and click on the inside area of these holes. Now when I try to add color back into this partial hole, it will not fill. This will only work for objects that are totally within the object. So the three uses, number one, it can be used to quickly add color to a black outline design. Two, you can use the magic wand to create holes. And lastly, you can fill those holes back up with color with the magic wand 